over an hour of free parking has long been the normal here in downtown Santa Barbara on the streets and in the garages. I'm Juliette Lamar in your community of Santa Barbara, following up with city officials about proposed changes to parking time limits and fees as the city looks for new ways to boost revenue. The city of Santa Barbara is facing a big budget deficit, $3.8 million to be exact. We've had a structural deficit for many years, going back from before the pandemic. Once the pandemic happened and we experienced a very large and sudden drop in revenue, uh, it really exacerbated that. To combat the deficit, the city is looking at several options, from cutting costs to raising fees. Maybe charging a bit more in some of the more crowded parking lots and charging less in some of the less crowded parking lots. Uh, we've looked at possibly changes to the subsidized parking period. Uh, we've looked at implementing a uh, validation system, the possibility of doing that where you'd get your parking validated by a business that you visited. These options don't sound good to business owner Michelle Beamer, who says the changes are going to hurt small businesses like hers. It comes at a cost to a small business owner in Santa Barbara. It's not thinking about, you know, what, what are the actual needs of the business owner. Beamer wants the city to focus more on business vacancy than parking. I, I think the bigger thing maybe to focus on is all the for lease signs up and down State Street and which is equivalent to urban blight. Any changes the city is considering would be implemented on July 1st of 2024. Until then, the city is asking for input from stakeholders and the community. So that we can hopefully uh, end up at a sort of a financial and operational situation that is uh, beneficial to downtown as well as keeps the parking system on good financial footing. To give your input on parking in downtown, you can attend the upcoming parking committee meeting at 630 Garden Street on Thursday, March 14th at 730 a.m. In Santa Barbara, Juliette Lamar, KSBY News.